So these are the few materials we will need for this particular DIY. We will need thread, which we'll use to join the straws together. We're gonna need spray paint, and like I said in a previous video, Vesli is really, really good. Um, we are also going to need a scissors to cut the straws, and of course, finally, we are going to need the straws, which are the main um, items in this particular DIY. So I'm going to go straight ahead and spray paint the straws, and let's get this started. Hey guys, so I have actually finished to um, spray paint my straws. As you can see, they are looking like um, silver metal right now and they look amazing. And that is why I advised you guys, even in the um, DIY candle holder video, that you should get this particular spray paint called Vesli because it's really good. It does the job. It's actually chrome. <laughs> So you can get that at Tesky supermarket for just 450 shillings and you're good to go. So straws. Here we have straws and I probably won't need all of this. They're actually really, really many. So yeah, I want to cut them into some specific sizes so that we can start the DIY immediately. And guys, I know I have done a video like this before, but it's actually on my Instagram way before I started YouTube. So I'm doing a repeat so that I can illustrate better. So that you guys can be able to learn and be able to make this light minutes for yourself. So we're only going to need this after I cut them. And yeah, our light panel will be ready. So let's get right into it. I will have a couple of um, 10 centimeter um, straws. I will have 8 centimeter straws. I will have 5 centimeter straws. I will also have 2.5 centimeters and 15 centimeters. I'm gonna start with 15. see i have actually finished cutting all my straws and this is the eight centimeters group which is 12 15 centimeters group which is six 10 centimeters group another six five centimeters group another six and of course the 2.5 centimeters group another six and we are ready this it's this easy cut and then now we want to join most of the straws using wool and we'll start by joining um, the 2.5 centimeter pieces, um, the 5 centimeter pieces, and the 10 centimeter pieces. guys we have already joined our five centimeter straws our 2.5 centimeter straws and our 10 centimeter straws and so the next step is to attach the eight centimeter straws onto the five centimeters um joint straws so since they're 12 we'll be adding two on each joint and i'll be showing you how to do that right now
attached our string so the next thing we're going to do is we're going to attach two of the eight centimeters one um straws on each of these strings <laughs> Attaching all the eight centimeters screws like this, we're going to tie them opposite each other. So this one and this one will get tied together. This one and this one will get tied together. This one and this one. Those two, those two, and finally those two. So guys, after attaching all these edges, we're going to go straight ahead to the next step, which is attaching this. This was the 10 centimeter um, um, attached straws. We're going to attach this to each of these um, edges, as you can see. This will be attached here. This will be attached here. This one will be attached here. That one there, that one there, that one there. Here's what we have after tying all these edges to <laughs> the other edges and so now it looks pretty much like a basket. We are almost done guys so now we have our 15 centimeter straws and we're going to attach each of these straws to this particular edges. So now at this point we are super ready. I'm going to join all this to this somewhere up here. So done with my light pendant i hope you guys got to learn exactly how to do this it's super 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 easy and of course it's extremely affordable i got 25 straws from a very very um nice shopkeeper and he sold them to me for just i don't know 20 shillings but i was also told even at the supermarket straws are like really really cheap so you can go ahead find straws you will need um maybe just 20 straws because i have so many extras that remained um of course the thread is usually also just around 30 or 50 shillings so you can imagine this is literally below 100 shillings always have spray paint in your house if you are you know looking to make different house decors because this always most times you'll find that you'll need the spray paint to turn things from plastic to metal from this to that so that is a number one thing that you should always have i hope you guys love this little um diy um i will show you the ones that i have on my on my bulb at the moment because like i told you guys i had done this um kind of um pendants before so i already have some up i don't think i'll be putting this up i'll figure out if i'll have a bulb to put it on but for now i'll show you guys what i have before and yeah, I hope you guys learned a lot and be able to make this for yourselves too. I already have on my bulb is this particular pendant that I made so many months ago, guys. And as you can see, it has been there for a while actually. But it's working amazing. A lot of people come here. Some usually think I bought it, but I did not buy this. I made this with straws and thread. And I have my light pendant. I hope you guys 
can do this for your spaces too i mean you never have to go expensive to have your space looking amazing and that is the main thing i'll be teaching you guys on this channel i always find the most affordable ways to make my own you know deco items and this is one of them i also have another one which is super tinier and it's right here so i also use this one i made this um after the first one and this one is much smaller because there's a cabinet right next to it so when you open the cabinet it's not supposed to hit the pendant and i was <laughs> it was it was perfectly sized to be honest so yeah guys i hope you enjoyed this feel free to like comment and of course subscribe i will be super super grateful and yeah see you guys next week with another video inshallah and love you guys so much bye bye